Divya, we are here in Nagpur, your hometown, and you are just right now here for the match of uh, Raunak versus Short, also Vidit versus Swidler. How did you find the overall environment and also the open tournament was happening? Uh, I think the way this tournament is organized is absolutely great because the this is the type of respect that chess players actually deserve and I was really happy to see how they were treated and uh, I think it's a great opportunity and also I'm very very happy that it's happening in Nagpur. I would have loved to play it but uh, I'm just leaving tonight for Asian Championships so sadly I cannot play but I think the organization is just great. Wow. So, so you were supposed to maybe play a match here, but you have a tournament that's happening, so you had to skip this. Yeah. Uh, but still, you are leaving today. You yet you found time to come here. Yeah. So, so what's happening? Uh, where's the Asian Championship? The happen? Asian Championship is in Kazakhstan, uh, and I'll be leaving literally tonight, and I, it will last, I think, around ten days. Wow, and and the Asian Championship is very critical because I think the World Cup spots are at stake. Uh, yes, but thankfully I have already qualified to World Cup. <laughs> because being the Indian champion. Yes. So, so I don't. It's good that I don't have that kind of pressure, so I can just play chess freely. So, what's your motivation to play the Asians? I just think it's a strong event overall and uh, it would be fun to play and represent India so. Mm. And Divya, because we are in Nagpur and because you love your city so much, mm -hmm. could you tell what are the good spots for chess players to go to in the city? Chess players? Yes, because there are nearly 700 chess players who have come from all across <laughs> India and the world here. Okay. Uh, I, is it for chess related no, 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 no. Okay. Anything. anything. Food, sightseeing, okay. anything. Uh, for sightseeing, I would suggest uh, Futara Lake. It's a beautiful lake and they are also building fountains and what I think a water show in there. So I think that's a good place to go. If you have more time, I would suggest visit the nearby sanctuaries. Like it's like an hour away from Nagpur, and you can literally see tigers and all the exotic animals. Uh, apart from that, uh, food. Mm. I would suggest you to try street food because I find the street food here really delicious. Uh, for if you want to, okay, I'll ask to check it too. It's, it's it's sounding really good because you know Nagpur will host many events and everyone will come back to this and see what are your recommendations and they can go there. Okay, I, I love the cafes here mm. and uh, they, they are very cute and you get great food and the ambience is really good. Where should we go for the cafe? Okay, uh, I can suggest a few. There's Villa One. I always get confused if it's 157 or 67, but it's one of the two, I think. And then there's Coffee Boo. Then I would suggest you to try uh, Fountain Sizzlers. That's a restaurant. Uh, I don't know where. I am so bad with navigation. But uh, the original, I think, the joint is here. Uh, and uh, the Sizzler there to die for. And of course, the dessert there is to die for. Um, Trillium Mall is a good activity spot and... Tulia. Trillium. Trillium Mall. Trillium Mall. Yes. Oh. Um, and the street food, which is your favorite? I love Pani Puri. Pani Puri? Yes. Uh, oh. There is a chart spot. I'm so bad at <laughs> navigation. I have lived in Nagpur my entire life, yet I don't know this. You, you see the spot? Uh, place I, I in your head I see the spot, but you but don't I know don't, the name I know how to get there hmm. I know the spot but I cannot tell you how to get there I only know how to get to my house and that's <laughs> all I know now but, um, but I know it's opposite to a temple okay and uh, so anyone who wants to eat Pani Puri should go opposite to a temple <laughs> <laughs> no uh, I'll, I'll find out the name and then I'll text you and then you can add it on something uh, then for the street food, then there's so uh, I think the street food opposite traffic park is good. I've not tried it in a few years, but when I was younger, I used to, I used to go there and it was great. And I also love the ice cream over here, Naturals and Baskin Robbins. But I think that's for that's everywhere. City. Yeah, that's every city. 
Uh, you put me on such a spot. I cannot think of anything. But these are great uh, recommendations already, and I think many people here will try these things out, and I think uh, they'll enjoy Nagpur. And it was wonderful seeing you here, although for a very short duration. And Divya, we wish you good luck for the Asians. Thank you.